The Pouncey brothers pounce on Mike Wallace. I'm Jim Baskell with the latest CSPN headlines. Both Marquise and Mike Pouncey, each having played with Mike Wallace in Pittsburgh and then in Miami, had some strong comments for the wide receiver. First up, Marquise, who's a current member of the Pittsburgh Steelers. First of all, in my opinion, he's a coward. I never want a guy on my team like that to walk out on your band of brothers. Forget the things that don't happen in the game. Say you don't get the ball a lot or you mess up and they pull you out. Forget all that. It's about playing for your brothers. Let's bring in Scott Brown, who covers the Pittsburgh Steelers for ESPN. Scott Marquise played three seasons with Mike Wallace in Pittsburgh. Where is he coming from, though, with that comment? Jim, I think there's two places. Uh, if you remember when LeGarrette Blunt left the field before Steelers win in Tennessee last November, they promptly released him, and Marquise Pouncey was one of the players who came out strongly uh, at or defending, not defending, but uh, but saying that the Steelers did the right thing and, and really uh, said he had no time for a guy who would who would leave the field or yeah. uh, walk yeah. out of his teammates as Blunt did. So I think that he was coming from there, and I think probably some of that is a little bit of a residue from Mike Wallace's uh, last season in Pittsburgh. Uh, you know, even towards the end of the 2011 season, which was his next last year with the Steelers, uh, you know, he, he started to show a bit of a selfish streak in the second half of the season. He had a monster first half. Uh, you know, was on a pace for over, I think, 2,000 yards, and then didn't get the ball as much in the second half. Part of that had to do with teams uh, rolling coverages more his way, and part of that had to do with mm -hmm. uh, Antonio Brown's emergence and, the, you know, the, him getting the ball more. So um, I, I think maybe uh, you're seeing sort of a, a, a two, two sides that's coming from is, uh, you know, Marquise Pouncey seeing a side of Mike Wallace didn't like toward Wallace's, you know, the end of Wallace's career in Pittsburgh, and then also uh, his anger over Blunt and, and probably hearing from his brother uh, yeah. what happened at the end of last season. Yeah, it's a little unorthodox since they don't play on the same team anymore, but Mike didn't have as strong a comment as Marquise had, but he did say obviously our organization felt away about some guys and got some of those guys off our team. I think it was the right move for everybody because at the end of the day, if you're not on the same page, you're not going to win football games. That was his thoughts about Wallace ultimately being dealt to Minnesota. Where was Mike Wallace? What was his response to both these pouncy comments? Yeah, he took the social media and, and sent a couple of messages out on Twitter basically saying that he considered the Pouncey brothers uh, little brothers. Yeah. He played with both and also saying that they're, they're friends. And, and then he, he, I, I guess he stuck up for himself when he said that um, I, I, he, he obviously took issue with uh, the coward comment, said that uh, he's as tough as anyone and uh, he's never backed down from anyone despite, uh, you know, his, his size as a wide receiver. So uh, it, it's going to be interesting the to see or, or and I doubt we'll hear uh, maybe what happens between those players behind closed doors. Although I, I can't see, given how strong his comments were, that Marquis Pouncey will have anything to do with Mike Wallace or try and yeah. uh, repair any breach with him. Uh, I don't know about Mike, as you pointed out, his 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 comments weren't as strident, which is a little odd considering um, you know he's the last one to play with Mike Wallace and. Uh, Mike Wallace left Miami under uh, what appear to be uh, a lot worse circumstances than in Pittsburgh. So uh, it's hard to make of this. And then, and then throw this in, last week, Antonio Brown's on social media lobbying the Steelers to bring back Mike Wallace. So go figure that one. I guess it just shows um, how... Uh, how why receivers sticking together. <laughs> yeah, why receivers sticking together. Wallace, in many ways, took the high road here, but both Pouncey brothers, who each played with Mike Wallace, had some strong comments that weren't too kind about the former Pittsburgh and Miami wide receiver. You can read more about this story right here on ESPN.com. With the latest ESPN headlines, I'm Jim Basquiat.